Welcome, peeps, to another video of, you guess it, Pokemon Showdown DX. I don't know if you ever watching these videos, guys. Ever since uh, manga fell in disgrace, and it isn't that watched, anyways. And seeing right now that that category won't be removing the safe chat anytime soon, felt as a huge hole, holding the tons of millions of people's hearts. Seeing such an addicted game falling to the dust. Oh well, that's how how games collapses. Guys, you know everyone will do mistakes, and those mistakes will be disastrous. Anyways, lately I saw. So the, the majority of those views in my channel are not related to my new videos. Well, there are some exceptions here. The logo effects, um, yeah, that is new. I already did some back in late 2015, and, and they're they're just almost almost the top. Five most watched playlists of this channel ever. Just barely missing its counterpart of uh, random stuff. Random stuff is another those logo bags and whatever. They don't have any audio editor. Uh, audio editor. That's what I meant to say. They're just simply visual effects thing. Because we'll either try to make it more, much more appealing, putting more effects on top, and on top of all that, to make it as unique, as unique as possible, despite that it sounds the same. Uh, um, I see. Despite that, the logo effects didn't have any any audio distortion or editing. They they seem to age well. That's a miracle. And the same goes for the random uh, logo effects from another logos that I made that doesn't have their own playlist. Cause there are two. Little of it, same thing. I think you people liked that randomness, guys. Not any of the organized logo effects were top top twelve of logo effects. All of the places slots slots. Slots, yeah, that. I think I pronounced it right. <laughs> Are occupied with everything from the random stuff, and I get it. 
I guess people like randomness, but this new Look FX edition, it is impossible guys, it will not make sense, blah, plus making lots lots of Look FX for each one, yeah, there's no way I, I can bear with that, so that's why instead I'm letting you guys both and buy oh, and buy your information. There will be another more one more spot for local edition, which logo effects of 2021 will be not only five but six local logos to choose from. Well, we all know. We all know. The four logos that they already occupying the spot. So in the meantime, we we're just going to wait for the most voted logo out of the bunch, and I I'm willing to recheck that poll and see the results and the winner. I later soon will. will reveal six slots but in the meantime let's just skip it up just keep it up straight in order because rules are rules also I don't want to be to be mm, bad, the bad one here but new videos show be as respected as the old ones. I mean, the old ones are short, I know, and I think my viewers got along with short videos. And I'm freaking surprised how how many people are, are subscribed to my channel, despite that my phone wasn't the most powerhouse in the world. In camera terms, because um, yeah, the camera was decent, but only when focusing on the um, on the screen of um, computers, televisions, tablets, or other phones, or when focus on the light, it would run smoothly. Under sun, under sun, yeah. The issue with that camera phone is when there's no any signs of light, which weakens this this smoothness from the last phone I used, and that's why some of my old deleted videos has smooth smoothly my throat is a pain that's why some of my deleted videos are had smoothliness issues so yeah that's why that's why it was oddly smoothly when my old phone was under the light of something in this case the TV and computer This phone that I have runs Android 10 and has a quite powerful camera despite that it only has one. It can even freaking record 1080p which is considered now HD unlike 720. But the reason why I use 720p is because of the less painful storage. It weighs even less. In the HD format, and you'll only gonna see 1080p in very short videos. I guess, yes, including logos. But come on, 
give the other category some luck. It's not hard. Okay, now let's get straight on, straight on the point. This is the 19 costume theme that I made for Pokemon Showdown for late 2019. First, we're we're looking at, at Starmie. The moves are Thunderbolt, Scald, Minimize, and Ice Beam. Hmm, pretty useful, right? But this man won't be living forever because it has a life for And to put it on top of all that, I didn't even bother to it, did it? So it's basically left that pretty much in the dust with the life for It didn't have any updates, so I can change the item. But to be honest guys, hmm, hits fairly well, the special attack may be kinda average, but... Uh, you can go for the most powerful action, instead of investing in speed by the nature, you could invest for special attack, but that will make Starmie slower. And yeah, Storm is pretty fast, but mm, it it can't it can't uh, outspeed anything. So that's why it's, it needs the most possible speed instead of power to be actually useful and not just a single waste of slots of goddamn steam slot. Next we have the second Celestia. Again we left the worst. Moves are Heavy Slam, Leech Seed, Iron Defensive for them. I think we already discussed that. Mm, I think the investment changes just a little bit. But here you have it. I'm not gonna bother telling them because I wanna save some. Speaking for most for most important stuff and scenarios. Okay, next. Plefki. The move has the moves Thunder Wave, Switcheroo, Attack and Toxic. This um, this was originally meant to have Lagging Tail or uh, uh, GX sense I think that was called the, the item that also does the same cheat effect. Mm, let me see. Yeah, I kind of mm, haven't memorized. Both Lagging Tail and Full Incense makes the Pokemon move less. Look, mm, listen carefully, listen closely. It doesn't. It doesn't make the Pokemon slower, it makes it have negative priority. So that's the first mistake that people comes with the items. So despite Frankster users, you will still move last. RIP. It's huge one. So the most viable thing is either a sticky spike, I think that that's the item. That's the item. Yeah. Mm, called that it. Yeah, and, uh, my throat is now failing me. But whatever, that spiky item is the opposite of leftovers. Removes it from the entire health. Simply like that. Plus, it has a benefit if it if it does a contact move. That item will stick to the opponent if they don't have an item, but it's useless because most of the Pokemon have items, so don't even think about that. So yeah, Iron Ball and Final. This is a defensive set, 
Hmm. Max defense, max special defense. Uh, the rest on all the health points. Mm, looking at Klefki stance is not the most surprising thing, but the only thing that saves it from being a total shit uh, is because it has Prankster. Klefki without Prankster will be a total waste of junk. I'm not not gonna lie. <laughs> okay. Next is Arceus Ghost. And we have we have our second shiny Arceus. As you can see, this one doesn't have the costume. See, because it's a special attacker. I mean, I will run costume C on a special attacker Arceus, but I never bothered to do that, and I don't think it will be effectively as a physical one. So. Yeah, spooky blade. Eh, ghost stuff. Besides, it's not as useless on the other Pokemon because it actually changes typing of judgment. And the other moves are hmm, Recover, Calm Mind, and Ice Beam. This is a uh, bulky Arceus. Max health, max health, max defense. I, uh, I, I meant to say one. 175 defense and 72 special defense. And the rest of the 8 points is special attack. It has the bold nature. Wait a minute. Oh, it doesn't have max HP. Yeah. Yeah. I thought it had it. But now it's just almost half of max HP. Yeah. And. You saw it anyways, so you, know, you ain't complaining. Here we have the Mega of the team. This is probably one of the most harder hardest speakings for me to actually get. I tried to several megas. I tried uh, Charles are Y and it wasn't that effective, anyways. I tried with Mega Glade. Nope, it failed. And the last Mega I tried was probably Mega Aerodactyl. But yeah, it has tough calls, but it's pretty much weak and helpless against priority. <laughs> Especially with these annoying bullet punches. But I didn't left that option of having a team with a Mega Aerodactyl. Probably will come in the future, but I don't think so. Because all the teams now are now occupied. Rip. But there, there's still a chance. Because my 2015 got. Missing, and I can probably hmm, recreate another from scratch. So I might include I might include a Mega Aerodactyl. So who knows? <laughs> Here have the moves: High Jump Kick, High Jump Kick, Fake Out, Bullet Punch, Nice Punch, and the shoes. Um, pure power is the same thing. I don't know why they. They name it, name it differently. Yeah, tell me down in the comments why. But anyways, max attack, max speed, and that's it. You have a pretty much destructive monster. And the last member, a zero hour with focus dash. Bulk up and plasma face, and outstretch and fire punch. Like. Starling, this one actually had a fourth attacking move. Like, so I'm going to reveal what it had before. Exactly, you guessed it right. LOL, 
it was pretty obvious, right? But effective as well. Also, Iron Tail could be a, a good option that could destroy rocks and ices, but there's that meager, meager accuracy of 75, so that's a huge risk in a stupid one. Superpower is just exactly powerful as close combat, but you don't lose attack. Instead, you keep it, but instead lowering your special defense. Mm, not big deal in a, such a speedy sweeper. Okay, and yes, the nature is act are to be expected. There we go. There you have it. Oh, and one little curiosity. This actually has element, unlike Starmie, because this one is actually rather fast, and it it isn't that independent to actually have Jolly or Timid for special attackers to outspeed uh, the opponents. This, this one can outspeed every, anything, most of the common meta game. But of course there are some exceptions, not including Gen 8 Pokemon though. And that will be, I think, Mega Gengar, the, the rare Electro, Negerado. Mm. I think I pronounced it right, Neganado, yeah. I think of Pulsing Sarawara with Jolly and Feromosa. That's one of the few. Mm. But not a, nonetheless, it doesn't have any flaws. Thank goodness. Okay, you wondering why I'm not housing too much? Well, it ain't wasting time to make the videos larger with bloopers. Okay, we have still buy like grass. Mm. Let's go to toxic. Uh, I can't switch around this shit. He does laughable damage, that's the good thing. Plus, we can sold this out with Iron Defense, not big deal. Shit. If it's the special attacking Charizard aka Mega Y, we will be in a lot of trouble, so I'm going to willing to switch. That almost killed me. But I guess that's the best I could do because there's a fucking Snorlax. Yeah, Crocodile is the ground type thing. Hmm. Yeah, we can outspeed the Charizard. Hmm, no problem. We're going to minimize. Although, the first minimize is not guaranteed to make the move miss. Okay, okay. That's good. Now let's attack with Ice Beam. Hmm. Come on, miss. Perfect. See ya! Actually pretty rare to see uh, Zabala. 
Okay, let's go to Skull. We can do sh something. Mm, we get the burn. The burn. Yeah, the burn. Another minimize to prevent getting ourselves hit. Mm. Okay, let's go for the final minimize and start damaging this Zero Aura already. Um, well, it was a given thing. Okay, if it's not just a crocodile, it's not a big deal. We can crush it away with close combat. Of course, Intimidate is a big issue. Okay. We can take care of that. Come here. There we go. Fake it out to ensure to break that focus ash and ice punch. Easy peasy. And we can get this Charizard frozen. Uh, I forgot. We can add a speed with that speed of 100. Yeah, that's the bat. That's the. Uh, <sighs> What's the word I'm trying to find? Mm, oh yeah, drawback. For being such a good hitter, it actually sucks. Cause uh, he doesn't have that much speed, and he's being forced to actually invest in speed instead of attack. That's a big fat shame. That is a good thing. We finally get through the opposite team. And Empoleon is weak to it, like very weak. Let's finish it with a powerful close combat. And that's why I run Fox Sash. Oh well. See ya, Empoleon. We have the silent treatment. Hmm. Okay, at least we have it one. Oh boy, this is going to be so fun. I bet I I don't have to use um Sarah Aura for this one. I can easily bypass everything with Starmie. Of course, here we have a big fat problem. Mm. Mm, I don't think it matters. Um, I mean, this thing is rather slower than this normal form but if it isn't best at the speed well let's bet our, our luck it all depends oh and it wasn't a critical hit eh, okay Um, that was a kind of lame battle because we all knew it was his PC. Let's go to the final one, anyways. After all, oh boy! 
Are you guys seeing this? We have everything slacking but durant. And I'm very surprised that this isn't actually some annoying gimmick. And I it'll probably go with entrapment. So, to thank. Keep that in mind. Now you'll suffocate and through it. Well, I just stole everything. Okay, I mean, slacking compared to Celestia. Mm, let's see what what damage you can do. Mm, underwhelming damage, but uh, I'll take it, I'll take it. A fat critical hit, of course. Very uh, What the fuck, it seems. Let's regain some of the health back. Uh, that was stupid of me, but... We didn't die to a critical hit. Hmm. And our special defense rose, making us even more ridiculously bulky. Okay, let's protect straight away. Good. Now let's set up the Lich Seed while well, he's sloping around. So this didn't miss. Now we are getting hefty recovery. <laughs> you just said GG and rage quit it. Uh, why not? I'm gonna replay this. Standard already negatively in competitive smogan, you don't want to imagine how Reggie Gigas is still suffering with his slow start. It's far worse than Truant. <laughs> Trust me. What a fat shame that they didn't got it fixed until Fat Gen 8. But mm, that wall Gen 8. Uh, pile of junk will be in another sub-series that I'm going to make uh, probably uh, during season 2 or season 4 uh, I'll tell ya it will be a surprise factor 
Anyway, subscribe and like the video and yada yeah, yada yeah, yada yada and watch my new videos, people. This is XDD X Ray Distributions and I hope you have a great 2021 so far. Yeah.